Tennessee Titans receiver Eric Decker's wife took an emotional stand for the anthem Monday and claimed her husband was tricked into participating in a protest. Jesse James Decker posted a lengthy explanation on Instagram about what the anthem means to her family and herself. She wrote the following One of my favorite things to do is sing the national anthem. I think about my dad, my uncles, my cousins, both grandfathers who fought in the Vietnam War. I think about how my grandfather Paul Paul Tim would ask me to sing the song for him every time I saw him, and how he would make me turn the other way to sing it, so he could just weep and cry as hard as he wanted, because it meant so much to him. I think about all of our troops I got to visit with and spend time with in the Middle East when I went overseas to sing for them. I think about all of the men crying because they missed their wives so much, or the man telling me he hadn't seen his baby girl yet since she was born. When I sing this song I think about them. This song is about them. It's not about me. That's what I think about every time I sing it. I love our country so much. And we should all love and respect each other, because this is the greatest country in the world. I see the love. I see the unity in all walks of life on a daily basis, and it makes me so proud to be an American. So in the words of Forrest Gump, that's all I have to say about that. She also said her husband didn't agree to participate in the Tennessee Titans not taking the field, and he was essentially tricked into it. My husband was not made aware it was time to go out for the game. Unfortunately a decision was made for him without him knowing, she told the media, according to TMZ Sports. You surely bet that more and more people associated with the league will begin getting much more vocal on the subject in the coming days. Follow David on Twitter tags National Football League, WAGS.